They do. Slendy will set it up for Swan again, and Swan again takes full advantage of E.T. Martin being a little out of system. Play gets it to Levick. Can't get it over. Hinshaw sets it up, but it's blocked at the net. Peyton Caffrey was there once again. Well, Slendy will try and set this one up again for Montgomery, this time with power. Did she get it in? No, she did not. It went out. And that's going to do it for the first set. Nicely done by Lindsey Proctor. Drops it into the space where UT Martin wasn't at. And, and they're saying that did get in, so the perfect serve there from Taylor Cross. I don't know what I've started there. Katie DeMeo able to get the point as that one deflects that point here for West Virginia. And that will do it. Ida Moody are not able to get past the block, and West Virginia takes advantage of some UT Martin mistakes there at the end of this. Aaron Slendy to Swain again. Man, Swain again. Hasn't been able to do that too much tonight. Gets the opportunity and takes advantage. Slendy again to Swain again this time. Perfect timing, no problem. Here's Levick, and Levick gets the kill. Nicely done by West Virginia. Slendy, Swain again, and that's going to fall. Really coming. It is match point for West Virginia. Ida Mudia. Was she able to keep that in bounds? She was not, so that will do it for the match. 25 to 11 in this third and final set. So the whole match, 25-19, 25-20, 25-11.